Developing tonight at 6, a home invasion in Norfolk this morning. We took you live to the scene where police found a man suffering from a gunshot wound, but so far no one has been arrested. 13 News Now reporter Stephen Graves is live on Thompson Road with the latest. Stephen. Well, Janet, this was a pretty scary situation. Police were all over Thompson Road when we came this morning. We're told a man who lives in this house just heard a knock at his door, answered it, and then things took a terrifying turn. This is Thompson Road opening back up to traffic early this morning around 10. At one point, shops near East Beach Marketplace had police as visitors. A suspect was on the loose after a man was shot at his front door. This woman lives nearby and knows the family. He had opened the door up and when he did, they started tussling and he yelled for help and that's when the neighbor called the police. She says the suspect tried to force his way in, but was unsuccessful and nothing was taken. And you didn't hear anything. No, I just woke up with uh, hearing him scream help. This man shares a wall with the victim in a duplex. He says he tried to help the man to safety, soon finding out he was shot in the leg. Yeah, he was just in a lot of pain, but uh, the guy's he's the nicest guy I've seen around here. Police say the victim should recover. Neighbors say the suspect was not familiar to the family he tried to attack. They say he ran off into the backyard after firing a pistol. Police checked surrounding areas, knocked on doors for hours. Little Creek Elementary was put on a brief lockdown at one point as a precautionary measure. It's the fear of what could happen next that has this family anxious for answers. Of course, we're paranoid because they have children in the home. I mean, it could have been anybody. It could have been any one of us. And tonight we're told police are talking to that victim in the hospital. The suspect still on the loose. We're told there is no threat the, to public safety. Meanwhile, if you know anything, call the crime line. Live in Norfolk, Stephen Graves, 13 News Now.